Hey everybody, I'm Jake Heavy Metal, and uh, welcome back to another Sour Patch Kids video. Um, and right here I have the Sour Patch. Okay, I've got the Sour Patch Kids Tropical. Now these are a completely different kind. Um, I picked these up at one of my favorite stores, and I've never tried these. I've never tried them. So, who knows what they're going to taste like. Um, it says here that uh, they're sour, then sweet. Um, like most Sour Patch Kids, of course. So, and I've never tried them in a box either. Never have. I know the last ones we had were in a, <laughs> in a bag. So, um, I'll try out these. Okay. I did not know they were in another bag. Or, I mean, they were in a bag. Okay. Well. Always be sure to handle scissors professionally. And, th and throw away your garbage. Not that you could see that, but anyway. Um, so they still have like the other um, Sour Patch Kids. They've got the different flavors. And um, oh, they got orange again. Yes. They have orange. Oh my God, you can smell that tropical smell. And I pretty much know what that smells like. I've had tropical punch before, uh, red tropical punch. Oh my God, this is gonna be good. Uh, let's see, what's the, um, I can't, I, I'm pretty sure, does it seem what kind of, uh, it just says artificial flavor, well no joke. Tropical. They wouldn't give you the real stuff. <laughs> tropical artificial flavor, about 3.5 servings. Uh, soft and chewy candy. Really? Hold on a minute. Surf, passion fruit, tropical twist, pineapple, paradise punch. Paradise punch. Well, I imagine they got to be for flavors, though. I mean, like, you know, a, a strawberry or watermelon. This here is, this here is like a red one. Strawberry or maybe watermelon. Um, ugh, pineapple. Not a big fan of pineapple, but I'll give it a shot. A little pineapple, tropical child, tropical child. <laughs> and then you have the orange, which is my personal favorite. Oh, that one's going to be great. That's that one's going to be incredible to uh, um, to chew. Oh, we have the. Looks like a great one in here, I think. No? What is that? 
don't know what that is. It smells funny. Hmm. I don't know. I guess I'll have to chew it to find out. Um, but I think that's really all the do. You know, I, I've noticed they don't have a green one. I noticed in this whole sack they don't have a green one. And I don't understand it. Unless the, the grape looking one is the green one. It's just a darker green. Maybe. But anyway, I'm going to start out with my favorite. The orange. So here's the taste test. Get ready. Uh oh. Well, first it was like a punch. And then it got better. It's like a fast punch, and then it got better. And now all the soury glaze is just completely getting annihilated off of it. Actually, I like these better. I like these better than the other ones. The, uh, I guess you'd call them the original Sour Patch Kids. I like these a lot better. You probably can't see them because I ain't got that mold. <laughs> but, you know. I like these. Let me have these back here. Yeah. Uh, I like these better. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what, I'm gonna get mad. And I'm gonna have me one of these nasty, <coughs> one of these nasty lime ones. <coughs> I'm just saying again, guys, when you've had a nice, sweet sour patch in your mouth for a while. And then you put a towel in there, it'll kick the crap out of you. I'm not kidding. Oh. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. 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 You know what, even though that's a really bad flavor, in my opinion, that's a really bad flavor for me. It's actually pretty good. I mean, in this kind of style of candy. Hmm. Hmm, I think I'll have me a red one. Hmm. It's actually pretty good too. I don't think it's as good as the orange one, but it's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's chewy too. Well, I think I'm going to try the, um, this, whatever the heck this is. <coughs> I don't know what this is.
Come on, don't be afraid of it. Oh, that's worse than all of them. If you haven't noticed yet, guys, I've got my Tropical tea or um, shirt on. I am tropical. I decided to do this the video because I just bought this from a um, thrift store. It's pretty cheap. And I love it. It's soft. It's a great shirt. And I don't usually go for these. I usually don't go for these kind of like Caribbean or uh, like island type shirts or, or whatever you want to call them. I don't usually go for them. But if you look at it real closely, you'll see there's like a tree. There's like Caribbean type of trees. Hmm. I think even on the back of it, you see like, there's like sunsets, blue skies, and kind of like weird flowers. And I usually go for them because they're not really this cool. But this is pretty cool. Mm. I'm going to try this here. Pineapple one. Again. Mmm. At times, I think that there's more sour stuff on these than there is in the other ones. But it also could be, now this is why I'm talking about the tanginess. That's why it could be. Um, these here are, I think, well, because tropical, they're like a, more like a tangy. Like when you're drinking fruit punch, red fruit punch, it's got that tang to it. So that's why these here, again, that's why these here, but that's why these here, um, probably more powerful than the others, because these actually have, um, I think more sourness to them, plus they're tropical, so they have more tang. So you put more tang in with tropical, or you put more sour, or you put something sour with something tropical, which already has tang. You got those two mixed together, and boom, you get something that's even more tangier and more powerful. Pure genius. I've noticed too that with these, these actually lose their sour taste a lot quicker. Now, I don't know if that's because they're tropical or whether they have a lower grade of sourness. Uh, so it seems like they lose their sourness a lot quicker than the original ones. Oh, but they're still chewy. They're still delicious. Mmm. I can't help it. 
The orange ones and the red ones are really the best for me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, no, that's a one too. Yeah. I'm sorry guys. I'm unable to talk very well. These are just so damn delicious. This is going to get nasty. Mm. 
Oh my God. Oh. No. No. Oh, you're seeing this ugliness. No. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't have no more. Oh. oh, I am bad, guys. I think. Oh. No. Mm. I think I'm okay now. But no. This is delicious. Mm, I'm going to have a glass of that again. I'm going to say it again. If you're a fan of. <laughs> if you're a fan of sour candy, then you want to get these. Mm. I scratch, <clears throat> I scratch um, that one notion off of uh, the chalkboard. I like actually these better. Well, I haven't actually tasted those in a while. It's been about a week and a half. But at the very least, these are a good choice too. And let me tell you something. These here, I think, are actually a, a more truer test than those. It's like, for example... <laughs> with these with these here seriously with these here um these give you more of a uh, these are for more of like a fan of sour candy uh, because I mean they pack a punch like I said in um before um the horrible ignorance approached um they actually pack a punch in the beginning they pack a punch to me and like i said again when when they um um oh i'm losing my head here Oh, mm. oh, these are good. These are very good. Mm -hmm. oh. But yeah, these are good. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mm. Yeah, I highly, I highly recommend these. Um, and again, these are, these are, I probably should have showed before. Um, uh, <laughs> these are Sour Patch Kids. <laughs> Excuse me. These are Sour Patch Kids Tropical. You can pretty much, I'm assuming you can pretty much find these in any store that sells food uh, and candy. 
but definitely go and get these. These are really good if you're a big time um, sour candy uh, eater, uh, tester, try it out, you know, what, whatever. But these are very good. Um, I did not know the Sour Patch Kids went tropical. Look at the little tropical ch child. Look at the little tropical. Look at his little orange brother. Or is he orange? Yeah. And he's got a little great brother. Great great brother right there. And a, a pineapple brother. Maybe. Pineapple brother right there. But yeah, these are really good. Um <clears throat> Yeah, these are uh, really nice. Maybe just one more. But yeah, for what? But the one thing that I really like about these is that they always turn in. To be in chewy, um, you can put a leg in your mouth, but really, technically, you can do anything you want to with these. You can let them lay in your mouth, you can suck on them, absorb them, the coating comes off of them, and um, yeah, the coating comes off of them, and They get real sweet in your mouth, especially if you got like three of them. They're really freaking sour though if you got three of them in your mouth at the first. But you know you can play around with them, you know, whatever you want to do, like I did. Put a cup one one in your mouth, you know, do it, do it gently on your mouth, and then put like two. Maybe later add three and do that and build up to it. And at some point you can even put half of them in your mouth and you buy a box and just see how much you can handle it. But, uh, but they're real good, you know. <clears throat> and I mean, this one already that I got in my mouth, it's already sweet. It was sweet probably about a minute after I put it in there. That's how long it was, I don't know. But it was good. Very good. Good job. The only thing that I don't like that I didn't like is that they don't have a grape them. Unless that this one here is a grape them. But it don't taste great. It don't taste great at all. I don't know what it tastes like. It's weird. But it don't taste great. Most time you have one like this and it tastes great. But this one don't. This one tastes like a pineapple. That one tastes like punch. The orange tastes more like orange. But that one, I don't know what it tastes like. It's tropical, it's fruity, that's all I know. But uh, wait a minute, let me, let me look. Okay, there's surf passion fruit. That's the orange one. Tropical tropical twist is what the purple one is. But I don't know what that would even be. I know. I bet that since I bet that since these, I bet those are different when it comes to like tropical, they're different. Like, for example, this uh, orange guy, he's something kind of tropical orange, 
but the purple guy is like, or the purple kid is more like, um, he's like something that's bound together. Like, of course, the Tropical Twist. So he's a different kind of flavor altogether. He's not, he's not even a grape or nothing like it. He's just a completely different flavor. Not even with the other flavors, you know. Um, like the Paradise Punch. Paradise Punch is probably not even strawberry, cherry, or nothing like that. It's probably just um, like ordinary punch, like you buy at the store, only you make it to a gel and you put some sour stuff on it. That's what it is. I bet that's what it is. It's not strawberry, it's not cherry, not like, not like that. Which, if you think about it, that's pretty cool, you know, because it actually does taste like a punch, punchish. So, I mean, that's what it's called, tropical, so, you know. But this was interesting, actually. Um, and as far as the nutrition facts, I don't think we need to know about the tra 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 tradition nutrition facts. We all get fat sometimes. That's just a force of life. We don't need to be bullied about it by things telling us how fat we can get. How fat we can get if we eat too many Sour Patch children. If we're too damn of a glutton. We just keep on eating the mutton. No, seriously. Uh, nutrition facts. Let's see. <clears throat> Let Professor Mitchell school you on nutritional facts. <clears throat> now, if you're not wanting to get fat, but you do want to stay pudgy, <laughs> you want nutrition facts. About 3.5 servings per container. Serving size, 12 pieces. I didn't even have that many. Well... Played the fifth. Um, maybe I did. Maybe I did. Well, you remember that. Serving size 12 pieces, 30 grams. Okay. So I got 30 grams of something. Okay. Calories per serving, one in. <clears throat> per box, 360. Wait. Per serving? Okay, total fat, zero grams, zero percent, zero grams, zero percent. Okay, why the hell did they just say that twice? Sodium, 25 milligrams, one percent. 85 milligrams, four percent. Total carb, 27 grams, 10 percent. 88 grams. Oh, per serving. Okay, I get it. Okay. So calories, that would be per serving. So per serving is 110 grams. So let's just say, if, for example, serving size 12 pieces. Okay, 12 pieces, I would get 110 grams, okay? So there's like 30, yeah, 20 pieces. How many is in the box? 3.5 servings. Okay, so there's not an equal amount of servings. So you kind of have to dicker with that. I see. So it's kind of like, okay, daily value. Zero grams, okay, total fat, daily value, total fat, zero grams, zero percent. Sodium, 25 milligrams, one percent. Total carbs, 27 grams, 10 percent. Total sugars, 23 grams. In cell added sugars, what that means, INCI, or is that an L? I don't know. 23 grams, 46 percent. Protein, zero. Okay. Now, per box, as in total, what's in this bad boy? What's in this tropical box? Okay. Daily value. Per box. Total fat, zero grams, zero grams, or zero grams, zero percent. Sodium, 85 milligrams, four percent. Total carbs, 88 grams, 32%. Total sugars, 76 
damn. 76 grams. Holy floating shit. Okay, hold on. Instead of the added sugars, 76 grams, 152%. Protein, 0 grams again. So you get no protein at all from this. Well, serves you right. I mean, they're not going, I mean, it's not like you're eating meat with your candy. So, I mean, you can if you want to. You can always eat a good steak while you're eating your soft match kids. But, you know, that's besides the point. Basically, they're just giving you a box of um, artificial flavored tropical children. But still, I mean, it, it, it's a good pick, you know. It's a good pick if you like candy. Um, I mean, heck, I ate it. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed myself a lot. I hope you enjoyed yourself too. I hope you enjoyed you. I hope. Ugh, I hope you enjoyed yourself watching me enjoying myself. Um, because that's what these videos are all about: us enjoying each other. Moving on. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. But anyway, moving on. 37 minutes in. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45 seconds, 46 seconds in. I mean, yeah, sorry. But anyway, time is time. You should love each other regardless of time. Don't let time get you. But anyway, who the hell wants to be my friend? Oh, sorry, I was reading the thing up there. But anyway, I get notifications all the time. Bing, bing. But anyway, um, I hope. Oh yes, I was gonna show you too. Um, real quick. Oh, I'll show it in more depth. But I don't know if you've ever seen this in the back of my um videos or not, but there is Superman, Clark Kent, with his other DC characters, Batman, Wonder Woman, and uh, all these other people, I don't know, I think. There's uh, one, one variation of Zoom in here, I think, um, but I wanted to show you guys that, because that's cool. Also, I made this too. I don't know if you guys can see it very well, but this is. I guess I'll move it over here. This here is something I made. I didn't make it very well, um, but this is basically a poster that I, that I wrapped in plastic wrap. I'll never. I never know when to. If I should look into this or this, I never know. But anyway, <laughs> tell me what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> I have a big pile of names. Uh, you're doing this wrong, that wrong, that wrong. <laughs> but um, no, I, I, what I did was is I put a plastic wrap around this. And so far it's holding out, but the thing is, is the, the pieces where it's kind of like bubbled up, you can see light. To where it's kind of it covers and masks over the pictures and I don't really like that so I'm gonna have to try and figure out a way to do some of that but basically this is um I can set this right this is the hunger this is the hunger games um poster kind of sort of poster um just pictures of, of Katniss Everdeen um which uh, it's uh, Jennifer Lawrence who plays uh, Katniss Everdeen, um, which I kind of thought the name was kind of odd, Katniss. But then after I started saying it, I started to kind of like it because, of course, it has cat in it, and it has Ness, Katniss Everdeen. Pretty good name actually, but uh, 
these are two of my favorite characters. Um, this is Katniss Everdeen, uh, Lawrence, or Lawrence Fishburne, Jennifer Lawrence, <laughs> Jennifer Lawrence, and this is um, Lee Harrelson, who plays the character of um, Haymitch, which I was actually skeptical about that um, name. I probably should make another video of this, but I, I'm excited to show this off. Eventually, I'll show this in a, in a better quality. But uh, this is, um, yeah, this is Hey Mitch, one of, one of my other favorite characters. Um, and just some really cool pictures of um, the uh, Mockingjay. Um, her, I think, in the Mockingjay Part 1. I Mockingbird, Mockingjay Part 1, I think. And that was Rue's death right there. I don't know if I can do it with all the crap on it. That's her when she's fire. That's when she was a little younger. Um, in the first film, I think. That was her. Uh, I'll have to make another video of this. But yeah, I just it's really exciting to be to make a poster like that. You know, I really didn't do it as well. It was actually kind of a fast thing I did. But, put it up there so you guys can see a little bit more of the stuff. Well, actually, you can see it better up there. But yeah, it's, uh, yeah, like I said, there's Katniss. Yeah, the light just keeps gleaming off of it. You probably won't be able to see much of it. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty well done for the size that it is. Um, but I couldn't help it. I just, I got, I bought it at a uh, thrift store for pictures. And, um, it's just a really cool show. It really is. I love it. Um, and, uh, but yeah, um, that's all the time I have for this video. And uh, if uh, you liked it, hit the like button and subscribe to more of my videos. And uh, hit the notification bell too. That way uh, you'll be notified every time I upload another video. And um, like I said, the Sour Patch Kids, buy them. They're a good choice. I liked them. I enjoyed eating them. Um, I I had a good time. I uh, hope you did too. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed yourself watching me enjoy myself um, because that's what these videos are about. I love making these videos and uh, like I said, I will continue to make these videos and enjoy it. Um, so um, as I always say, I thank you for watching. And your time is precious, so I appreciate your time. Thank you, and have a good day.